I read my Bible every <laughs> once in a while and um, read some healing scriptures and uh, always said my prayers and prayed for healing and strength to get through it. And I always had a comfort to know that beyond all the doctors and everybody on this earth, there was a greater power that was helping me and taking care of me. But, um, um, right now I'm, uh, I'm doing great. Uh, I finished up with all my chemo treatments in uh, Feb early February this year and um, got to go back to school and finish the eighth grade and uh, graduated with honors and I just had a great summer. I uh, went to Myrtle Beach and uh, I'm, back, I'm in high school now and really enjoying that. And uh, and I just like to um, just thank God because uh, just for without Him I I couldn't have pulled through this and uh, just for helping me through it and just for all the many blessings and just thank all the contributors for the relay for life because it's a word worthy cause and one day we'll find a cure and. Uh, I like to um, close with a verse of scripture. It comes out of uh, Mark chapter 10, verse 27. With men it is impossible, but not with God, for with God all things are possible. And uh, that verse just gives me hope, and uh, it's just a great verse. And uh, um, how many survivors do I have out there? Praise the Lord. And, uh, uh, I guess that's about it. Just uh, <laughs> thank you for your time. Thank you, Gabe. That's really the reason why we're here. Survivors are our heroes.